What? What's your deal? What, huh? <gasps> Tell me why. Why are you always in my head? All these horrible memories inside my head. So why do I see your smiling face, too? Why does your face show up, even when I think you're a nuisance? Why? Why are you... Just like I told you before, I don't know your painful memories. That's simply the truth. I hate it. But there's nothing I can do about that. But... I can slowly replace your future with something fun. Maybe we could play Ninja Heroes. Or go somewhere with everyone together. Come on. Let's do all the things you couldn't do before. I can do those things for you now, too. I wish that you'd give me a chance. One last chance for you to not hate Ninja and the Ninja world anymore. Boruto. Boruto. I... I... You disappoint me, Nanashi. Were you not going to destroy the ninja world to avenge yourself? Was that not the source of your hatred? <laughs> In the end, you were just a child. I'm taking Nanashi. I have no need for something that is no longer of use to me. Take her. It doesn't matter. No use to you? Seriously? You just see Nanashi as a tool to use. You're doing the exact same thing that her clan did in the past. I'm nearly a god at this point. Feudal lords, the five Kage, the relics of the past. Every last thing, all of it, is beneath me now. And he sees you the same way. Are you okay with that? <laughs> I don't care how anyone sees me, as long as I can make my ninja tools. He's helped me create so many. I've never been happier. You're really starting to tick me off. But I'll take your offer and take Nanashi with me. Yes, I'll allow you to take her. Although, only after I have fully used her up. What do you mean? <laughs> what? <laughs> Nanashi! <laughs> What's going on? Young Lord! That's... <laughs> What are you doing? Did you think we broke her seal without any sort of plan? I'm extremely cautious by nature. The Forbidden Curse Tag. Have you heard of it before? First you set a curse tag on your target, and then you can use it to control them. You allow them some degree of freedom, but they will never betray the user. Additionally, you can even take full command over them, should the need arise. Don't you think that's the perfect way to control a living weapon? 
We've updated it to a modern version. What do you think about that hair ornament? <laughs> it's quite fashionable, don't you think? I'm the kind of man who cares about appearances. I still have a use left for her. To fulfill my wishes, I will draw forth the terrifying power of the weapon in its entirety. Now! Your shackles have been loosed! You're free to go all out, my weapon! Nanashi! Boruto! <laughs> Boruto, don't hesitate! <gasps> Fight! Fight, or else you'll die! But... Don't worry. You just need to fight as you always do. If you can knock her unconscious, we'll be able to help her. I'm afraid it won't be that easy. <laughs> you are talking about an Uchiha weapon. A lowly Genin is no match for her. Boruto! You don't have time to think about it! Fight! <laughs> Here no, she snap out of it! Can you hear me? This character is so wrong in every way. You notice in every scene where she was like treated as a weapon, they're all dudes on the battlefield and everything, and somehow you have a living weapon they made, and you know, they made it from nothing because she I don't know, I mean it's not like she had a, some extraordinary power. They just embedded her with the power, right? <laughs> So this character is all wrong on every level. What I do? How can I get Nanashi back to normal? If I can't show. She's so strong. She's on a completely different level. So this is her real power. Boruto, concentrate! Here goes! Here goes! Here goes! Here goes! What is it, man? Is that all you have? No. The fun is just beginning. <laughs> This is me. Shit. Shit. Here goes. Here goes. Here goes. This is nothing. Nanashi. This is a surprise. I didn't think you could defeat Nanashi. Hmm. Perhaps she still retains some of her autonomy. That could be allowing her to hold back some of her powers. In other words, if I strengthen my control over her so she loses all sense of self... Are you okay? Huh? Oh. I think he's dead. That's the... Dad! No 
away! Just leave it to your dad and his friends. Now you've really done it. You'll pay. So the sinners have arrived. Sinners? You're one to talk. You're one to talk after sending the ninja world into chaos. <laughs> you have no idea just how big a sin you've committed. What do you mean? Our group's name is Zero. Because it is our mission to take the ninja world and reduce it to zero. And for what reason do we wish to reduce it to zero? When the world is in the midst of peace and prosperity? It's because this current world you've created is wrong. It must be corrected. Hmm. Sounds just like someone plotting a takeover. You are familiar with the underside of society. I expect you are well acquainted with the rampant spread of evil. But Zero is different. Everyone sought me out to change the world. While I may have been the one to form this organization, we are made up of people who willingly joined the cause. They volunteered to help and fully endorse my beliefs. What are you saying? I guess I should start with the end. You see, the world simply craves conflict. Living within a world of peace, a world of order, that may be satisfactory to you. However, peace eliminates conflict, and order defeats the entire purpose of ninja. This new age you created through the fourth great ninja war has created a rift of non-conflict behind the scenes. When the world doesn't seek conflict, where are the ones suffering in this rift supposed to go? They came to Zero, looking for the place they belong. Those who can only express themselves through fighting. Those who wish to test their strength. Mercenaries. Among them are some who lost their family in past conflicts and are looking for a way to release their anger. They seek conflict. They wish for a world where they can hurt, draw blood, and vent their emotions. They are seeking the reign of power Pain strived for. No way! Pain. Nagato, what he wanted was the peace that would come after. The methods you use. They're just encouraging conflict for no rhyme or reason. And what is the issue with that? History is cyclical. War ends, peace comes, and then we return to war. That is the way things are. Also, while I support Payne's beliefs, I don't wish to do everything he envisioned the same way. I am myself. I'll design my own era, one based on his ideology. In short, I'll destroy the current ninja world, and I will reinstate a time of war. Once that is accomplished, I'll become a god that surpasses pain! How foolish. Is that all you wish for? Your plan demands too much! Too many sacrifices, on your side and ours! Face it, you'll only spread misery throughout the ninja world! Great aspirations come with great sacrifices. The members of Zero are well aware of this fact. Even Nanashi. She agreed to use her abilities to support the organization in order to destroy the ninja world. Nanashi doesn't want that anymore. <laughs> yes. She lost the will to fight thanks to someone putting ideas in her head. She can't even be controlled anymore. She is nothing but a nuisance now. <laughs> However, she can still be of use to me. Boruto Uzumaki, 
You said before that you wanted to take her with you. You can have her. I've already used her up. down. He's faster than I thought! Alright, let's kill this Murs guy and get this over with. Gone too far! We can't let you get away with this! You heretic. I'll end you here. <laughs> What an honor it is to be fighting the strongest ninja of the present day. Uh, let's Try do some it. of this! Water's done! Water's done! Water's done! Let's do it! Let's do it! Let's do it! Looking at you fills me with so many emotions. The hell? Style. Style. In my younger days, I fought with pain directly to the brain of civil war. That was when I damaged both of my eyes. I became blind. But I did not speak down. That was because I was drawn to Kane's ideologies. We managed to launch a revolution. However, you defeated me. And Hidden Rain decided to go down the path they stole. I was left behind. A relic of the past, and disappeared from the main stage, along with dangers and dangers. lucky. If it weren't for you, Pain wouldn't have had to die. I wouldn't have had to create Zero either. Your existence has, to my annoyance, greatly influenced my life. We'll corner him like this! <sighs> I should say, I'm impressed. I can't believe you thought you'd win with skills like that. Don't underestimate us. Sasuke and I are powerful. <laughs> Victory is at hand. I was correct to lure you in here. What are you talking about? Ordinarily. I'm sure that my power would be no match for you. But in this case... Right now... Unfortunately for you, you're already exhausted from all your previous fighting, so you have little energy left now. The simple fact is that you failed to best me. That's why you think you can win now? You slipped up. You see, you can exhaust us all you want. But even so, in the end, we're the ones who are gonna win this fight! <laughs> Do you know the Yachihoko ability? The ability allows one to freely control the chakra of the person who is linked and return it to the user without limit. The Uchiha clan used this ability to try to enhance every visual jutsu they could. They failed, but the emergence of Yachihoko shook the world. That's Nanashi Uchiha's ability. Yes. Nanashi's ability. A skill that only she has. One that only she can use through her Sharingan. But then, there came a day. I learned something. Something very important. A newly developed artificial eye. The higher-ups didn't approve but it would return my sight to me, and grant me great power as well, so... <laughs> Wait! 
You gave him those artificial eyes, Tegusei? Yes, I did. I gave them to Lord Mertz. I was able to get very good data as a result. Securing a supply of the chakra was difficult, but I found a way to resolve the issue. Be careful! The artificial eye Tegusei created is able to copy visual jutsu. Copy? Wait a sec. You mean... Exactly! It imparts a wondrous ability to its user. It allows them to use visual jutsu that had previously been limited to clan bloodlines. You see, I have created the ultimate artificial eyes. These are without a doubt my masterpiece. The fact that he has them means... <laughs> yes. I have Yachihoko! Naruto! Yes. <laughs> I can tell you see how dangerous these eyes are. Although, I'm afraid you're too late. <laughs> Countless ninja are already linked together. Joined by the engraved Tsukuyomi. Are you aware of what that means? I'm sure you are. Their chakras are in my hands, and I am able to freely draw forth from them as I please. The vast amount of chakra is able to fully unleash the Mangekyo Sharingan and be able to recreate that power! Is this? Come on! Of course, since it's a copy, there are some visual differences. But even so, it should be more than enough to defeat you. You are no longer the most powerful ninja.